the snow run is back this is episode eight again a big thank you for your support so far on this series you guys have been absolutely incredible i'm having so much fun with this game this trailer has been an available task for so long pretty much since we arrived in smithfield so we're gonna try and save it hopefully this probably isn't the right vehicle but yeah i want to explore with the car so that is the plan of this episode to explore find some watchtowers just explore the map in general but i'm slightly concerned about where we take this trailer hmm i am in interested <laughs> i might just try and winch it i don't know we'll see what happens here but wow i didn't realize how muddy it was wow we are sinking <laughs> wow okay then obviously the dip is unlocked um, also, I've now got a high, a high gear. So if we get really stuck in the mud, we can put into a high gear, spin up the tires a little bit more. It just seems to help, which is very useful. All right, let's reverse into it. I don't know if we can actually attach it, but I'm just going to winch it otherwise. That's even possible. Oh. Uh, yeah, can I attach the winch? I'm pretty sure that's all I can do. Attach the winch at the back. Uh, yeah, so it's now attached. I mean via cable <laughs> Not via the the appropriate means right, We need to get out of here. So let's lock the diff And let's go. Let's try and winch it out. That is stuck Severely stuck I've got to drop it off here. So I'm trying to work out a good route Could go all the way back to here Potentially or back to here but that area is just covered in trees. That's the where I just came down. So... I can just got this rock face. <laughs> is that a good suggestion? Probably not. Probably not. Let's winch it out of here. It's been a task that's just been there for so long. I'm like, I have to do it. I have to help this poor innocent soul. Get his trailer back. So I believe this trailer, which is obviously a smaller one, could attach to my Chevy, the first vehicle we got, for example. Unfortunately, the, the Khan does not have any, I don't think any trailers available in the game. I guess it would just be a bit OP otherwise, I don't know. It is more of a scout vehicle. Let's go! It's actually pulling pretty well, like, obviously that's a lot of weight, and it's not really attached to the vehicle properly. It's, it's doing a pretty good job. Well... Why do I why do I talk for? Why do why do why do I speak? Why am I getting stuck on here? Like a branch, really? That's what's stopping me. Come on, that's a oh no. Wow. Uh we're good. Is it rolled back down? Oh, you are kidding me. Is it rolled back down? It's rolled back down a little bit. Uh right to reverse a bit. And then just slam on the brake. Handbrake. Whoop. Handbrake is on. Let's try and winch it again. <laughs> that failed. Right, it's attached. It's attached. Okay, got it. Got it, got it, got it. Let's try that again. I think I swear I just hit a branch. That's it. That's it. Or maybe that was that, that rock. I don't know. Come on, we're so close. It's not like I can winch do anything either because I'm still, I'm already I'm already using the winch. That so won't work. Right, I think we made it. I think we almost made it. We're doing good. Yes, yes, yes. That worked like a treat. <laughs> well, it didn't go completely to plan, I guess, but got it working eventually. Right, it's now time to deliver. Get it done. Keep pulling it. Right, I need to work out. Yeah, if we just go into this little trail thing here, we should hit that main road in a jiffy. It actually worked. It actually worked. It's a miracle. An absolute miracle. We are so close. Yes, look at it go. It is relentless. It's so bouncy though. To be honest, it's a little bit too quick now. I'm not gonna lie, it's a little bit too quick. But yeah, 
I, it's such an extreme off-road vehicle, and I love it. All right, let's park it up. Oh, don't, don't ruin it now. I have your trailer. That's it. Is this it? Woo, we did it, eventually. Woo. Was it worth the money? I don't know. So, I think we want to get rid of these boulders. So, we need uh, service spare parts, which is basically here. It's not actually that far at all. So, I'm going to... Um, I guess recover. I don't think we can train trucks. No. So, I have to recover and come back. Fleet Star, you're up. Impress me again, like you always do. Like you always do. The amount of times I forget to drop the handbrake, it, it's quite, quite incredible. To be honest, I'm not really used to doing it in video games. Normally, you just go. <laughs> you don't have to think about it. You just seem to move automatically. Ooh, actually has oil rig drills. Not enough space. What? Okay, that's incredible. Uh, vehicle spare parts and service parts. So we need service parts. So these boulders are pretty pretty big so we're gonna try and smash them get rid of them and again it will open up the the bottom part of the map there's not really like an optional path so this all has to go yep who <laughs> put these here these look completely dead move them i mean we could move them that, that that's a good point <laughs> that's possible oh that is muddy that is muddy that is soggy Uh oh, please don't get stuck. Oh great. These soggy pools of mud are just honestly terrifying. Am I just, I've just buried myself. Great job, great job. Attach the winch to the front again. I see a tree right there, that's perfect. I'm guessing once we get a better winch, it can go a bit further or it's got more thrust as well, I'd imagine. Is that the right word? Is that the right terminology? Because the winch is just... It is ridiculous how good it is. It helps us out so much. Especially that last episode. Don't. Don't. Don't tip. Don't tip. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. There we go. Not going to tip. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, oh my god. Please. Ooh, this is meant to be a simple job. Why is it not simple? Can you like, please just even up? Like, honestly, it's scaring me. Oh, finally. I like how it zooms, it always zooms right in. It's like, well, are you gonna, you're gonna fall, are you gonna fall? No, I'm not. Don't zoom in. Oh, there's more water. Why? Why, 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 why? It's actually pretty deep. Ooh, that is deep, that is deep. All right, it seems to be just managing to just go through it. Got the diff locks anyway. Getting rid of these boulders is not easy. But we have arrived. Whew! That got hairy. Just a little bit hairy. Cargo management. Done. It is done. The boulders are no more. I'm sort of tempted to keep going in the truck even though i want to go in the car i don't know should we just keep going because we're like already here why not even though the car is a lot quicker we'll have a look over the over the hill see what there is to look at look at that view man that is incredible yeah i have turned down a few seconds you can probably sense the game is a little bit more smoother now that is a view wow that is a view indeed. My turning circle is not great. Oh. Full lock. Still just didn't seem to do much. Go a little trucky. My little flit star. That's it. Keep it going. This is more of a rock issue. So some wheels will be in the sky. Some are obviously on the ground. And it's just, it's just yeah. Makes it a little bit tricky. Uh, what exactly has happened here? <laughs> I don't know what's happened. Attach the winch. Ideally over here. Yeah, perfect. And winch it. That's it. 
That is a strong looking tree. It looks skinny, but it's got some strength. It's got some good strength. Again, I probably should have switched back to the Khan, but I didn't. What can I say? Oh, it was a watchtower. Damn. Tricked me. Okay, this is muddy. Just keep it going. Keep it going. Is that a vehicle? Can we grab that? If we can grab that, that'd be perfect. Come on, let me grab it. Let me grab it. Is that mine? Can I switch? Yes, the new truck has been discovered. Isn't that the start of vehicle? I mean, still, I'll take it. So we can change. There we go. Woo! Oh, yeah, baby. Okay, the gearbox is not in great shape. We're just seeing that. Yeah, we're just seeing that. It doesn't even move that much quicker. You think it'd be like, yeah, let's go. It, it, it's, yeah. It needs some upgrades. So they, they may actually be off some off-road tires already. I don't know. I'm not sure. I just realized the number plate, I'm pretty sure it says Savage. Or an abbreviation of Savage. Why did I set a navigation point to there? I don't know. Yeah, the gearbox is uh, its already struggling. It's gone straight into neutral. Why is it doing that? Come on. There we go. What if I can... How, can I repair it? I can't even recover it. Yeah, durability is down by two points. It's down to a C. I've got a feeling you're going to get stuck, aren't you? Is it me or the truck is actually quite a bit better? Yeah. <laughs> it's definitely better. <laughs> Right, let's go to the map. And we can switch back to our Fleet Star. Actually, what I might as well do, it makes sense, doesn't it, to switch back to the CK1500. Which, again, we've had this vehicle before. It's what vehicle we started with. But again, it's a good little run around. We can also sell it. Keep on trucking, as some would say. Again, don't know why I'm doing this. I should switch back to the car. And we probably will do it at some point in this episode. But, like I said, while we're here... And we may need the flatbed at some point. You never know. Um, as well, we've got enough fuel as well. Plenty of fuel. Keep going! There we go. And we can bump into vehicles like we did just a second ago. Whoa! It's so random. The mud just sort of... Yep, yep. Okay, we're stopped in mud again. Feels like a nice... Nice sort of hard surface, and then suddenly you just drop. The wheels sink. The vehicle sinks. I think it's very terrifying very quick. Man, this map is massive, isn't it? Yeah, I really want to try and get to that watchtower. Almost vengeance for not getting to this one in the last episode. Sweet, sweet vengeance. Don't get stuck in the mud. Don't get stuck in the mud. Nope. I need to look out for like almost like warning signs because I, I honestly, most of the time I can't tell what's coming up. I guess that will come with a bit more experience. Looks like we may have to cross the water. Hmm. Great. Fantastic. Again, I'm not sure. This is definitely deep here. Yeah, see, I saw that coming. I mean, there are signs that when you're close to water, little lakes or pools of water, but sometimes it just, you just sink. Yep, okay, this is mud then. Can we get across that? <laughs> oh, what am I doing with my life? I'm not sure my, um, my ego can take another hit, though, if we don't reach that watchtower. I just don't think I can do it. All right, let's uh, go straight into lock diff mode. And there's also, I mean, there's a few things for me to grab, but not, not really. Yeah, this is going to be slow going. Slow going indeed. We're getting across it, but it, it's, it's, it's slow going. I'll be very intrigued to see what the Khan could do with this. Okay, this game is so pretty. I can't get over it. How pretty it actually is. Right, we need to attach to something that's actually in front of us. 
Uh, I guess that will do. Cannot wait. Cannot wait for off-road tyres. Nice bit of ground here. Lovely. Guys, we're trucking. We're going to get across it. We're going to get across it. Believe. I'm still looking for vehicles and trailers as well in the background. We're trucking. Yeah, we did it. Screw you, river. Ha ha. I made it. Screw you. Right, to the watchtower. I'm getting some serious deja vu right now. But luckily we've got fuel this time, so that's a positive. Ooh, there's a contract there. Oh, there's a service truck there. Do we have any damage? Got a little bit. Not not much, to be honest. New trailer discovered. Good job. Goodbye, letterbox. Lost bags. What is what is what is that? I'm intrigued. Um, truck with a crane is recommended. Four cements. There we go. Repair. See, so yeah, there's a tiny bit we can do. It's not really that bad, is it? Two damage on the engine and two damage on suspension. It is done. Do I take the trailer with me? Uh, no. <laughs> I don't. Again, I believe you can sell the trailers. So there is a temptation to do that. But at least we know where it is. I can always come back for it. At some point. For now, our task is to get to this watchtower. So I'm guessing... We see a bit more of the map there. We go to there. And we keep on going. We keep on trucking. Let's go. Thank you for the uh, repairs. Appreciate that. Mr. Service Truck. I'm going to try and avoid this big massive muddy pool don't fancy that and then which way exactly do we go here which one is it I'm guessing it's straight on yeah straight on we're gonna make it <laughs> don't why did I say that why did I say that I don't know why I said that I am a stupid idiot oh god okay and suddenly it gets a lot trickier I hope this is the right way. It's also very, very hilly, very bumpy, a bit muddy. By now, you know the routine, I guess. I actually can't wait for the snow now. The snow is very different. Obviously, it's a lot softer. And in the game, it's very different as well. The physics are actually pretty incredible. I believe it's the first time snow's ever been in a game like this. In the Mud Runner franchise, I guess you can call it. I think snow's not been there at all yet. So, like, I'm now going like, what I feel like the wrong, I'm going the wrong way. How do I get to this? How do I get to the watchtower? Ugh. There's no way I can go up that, surely. Maybe I can give it a go. Let's give it a go, I guess. I will not give up on this. I will get to this watchtower. It's the last thing I do. Okay. I'm going to do it. He looks tough with himself, doesn't he? Look at him. Look at him go. He loves it. He loves the challenge. He is Amazon's best man. He delivers on the dot. On time, every day. He is an epic man. We are so close. Finally! Look at that view! We did it! Yes! Repair the truck discovered. Ooh. Launch observation. Let's have a look. That is quite the view. Wow. Incredible. Whew. Ah, so there is a repair truck task. And... A trailer there nearby. Ooh! Get away to Island Lake. What? That's intriguing. So they want me to repair the truck, restore it. So we would take the trailer down to here and repair it. That's basically the goal for that. <gasps> One second. One second. 
International Transtar 4070A. Love it. Could I get that? I mean, that would be quite the task. Uh, <laughs> I think we should start with the repair first. Get yeah, we'll upgrade up there as well. Very nice. Yeah, we should start with do the repair. Go to the service trailer. Grab that. Repair this truck. And we're going to try and grab this. Probably fail, though. Okay, service trailer has been acquired. Not going to lie. It feels heavy. Yeah, very, very heavy. And I think fuel... I don't want to... Yeah, I'm worried about fuel, actually. If we want to try and get to that... That new truck, it's going to be tricky. But... We'll give it a good shot. We'll give it a good shot. That's all we can do. I'm worried we might be stuck here. Hmm. Turn my headlights on. I just... We are sinking. The service trader is just so, so heavy. If we can maybe detach it briefly. And then just try again. Just see if we can try and get out. Attach a winch. Attach a winch. What, what have I attached to? Do, 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 do. I want to attach to that tree right there. Okay, we can get out. Interesting. So we could try and then winch the trailer towards us. And this is very slow going. I apologize. So try and pull it towards us. Like I'm going backwards. That's not what we want. Even though the handbrake is actually on right now. Is that close enough to attach? Yes. Come on, come on, come on. That trailer is so heavy. Like, I would not be stuck if I didn't have that trailer attached to my rear. Ah, oh, we can get to that tree right there. Perfect. Pull! Pull! I so hope this is worth it. I've been burning so much gas as well. So our dream of getting to the, uh, the new vehicle might be getting slimmer by the second. Which would seriously suck and it's getting late as well oh hello random lag don't know why it does that kind of random just keep on trucking it's literally just around the corner we're actually getting very very close now come on we're so close so where's the broken vehicle oh that's not what we wanted to see really that's not what we wanted to see. Oh, poop. Yeah, you can get a service unit. Um, so instead of the flatbed, we'd have like a service unit on the back. Which maybe I should have just bought, potentially. Wow. I'm already stuck here, let alone when we actually move forward. But we need to winch it. Definitely winch it. Is there a way I can maybe try and avoid this water? Because I would like to take that route, basically. Try to see if we can try and scoot on around this way. Come on. It's now very hilly as well. The service trailer is still stuck in the mud. We can do this. We can do this. We can do it. Only 62 litres left. No. It's going to happen again, isn't it? Freaking fuel. Uh, there's the broken truck. I think I've managed to avoid the water. Potentially. Whew. So that's the task. Except I'm doing it. I'm getting it done. Hopefully... You can repair vehicles piece by piece, if you wish. Right, here we go. Repair. Uh, there it is. That's what we want. Hopefully it's got enough. It should do. So that's the gas tank. The wheels are completely fine, so that's good. Engine needs some help. Suspension needs some help. Gearbox needs help. Done. Did we do it? I hope we did it. I think we did it. The task seems to be there no more. Perfect. Haha. 
And I don't think we can switch, right? Change vehicle? No. That's their vehicle. We just helped them out a little bit. Right, let's detach the trailer. And let's go. This is not going to be possible, but we'll see how far we get, <laughs> I guess. What trailer is that? Just a sideboard trailer. Or we could try and get to the island lake. But there's not real any, really any benefit to that. We're going to try and get to this. International Trendstar 4070A. Can we make it? So I'm going to go to that point there. For this trail round. Let's so go there. Go there. And I guess maybe go here. And across here. And then hopefully to the truck. That is my route. I feel so much lighter. It feels so good. But yeah, again, fuel might become an issue. All we've got to do is get within the vicinity. And we can grab it and then recover it. Oh, God. We stuck now. Why are we always stuck? Okay, we might be properly stuck here. And there's no attachment points. Oh. Doesn't even look that bad. Cause it, I guess because it's dark as well. Oh, we can steer out of it. There we go. Keep steering. Oh, it seems to just stop. That's it. Use the horn, Scott. That will help. I believe if you're actually in water and you do the horn, it actually like, sort of does like a pulse for the water as well. Like a ripple effect. Are we out? We out? We're out. We're out. We're out. This is not what we want right now. If we're getting stuck here, we're going to have some serious issues. And I would really like to try and drag that service trailer with us so we can actually try and repair it. But it would not be possible. Like the fuel would be, we'd be out of fuel. We wouldn't get there anyway. It just wouldn't be possible. Oh my god. That is a river of water in front of us. Yay. Fantastic. Let's try and get through it. Splash. Oh, that is deep. Oh my god. Oh my, oh my, oh my. That is real deep. Where's the snorkel? It's just that, oh, that is deep as hell, man. It's really deep. I did not expect it to be that deep. I managed to winch onto something. A broken tree. Ooh, this is terrifying. Should we try and skip some time? I don't know if I want to do it or not. Yeah, screw it. Why not? I just want to see it. You know, it's, look at that. We are deep. Real deep. There we go. We try and grab onto something else. Attach to Again, this is wasting fuel. Precious, precious fuel, fuel we don't have. My flatbed's all dirty and wet. Winch it out, winch it out, winch it out. I did not realise how deep that was going to be. I had no idea. That was kind of scary. Try and grab onto that. Yes! Pull it! Pull it! 33 litres left. There is not a chance in hell I'm making this. Absolute. Look how much progress I've made. I've gone from there to there. Fantastic. Just great. Oh, I'm gutted. There is not a chance in hell I'm going to make that. Not a chance. Look at that. What is that? Push us through it! Look at the speed we're going and the litres of fuel we're, we're using. It's it's just a little bit crazy, to be honest. Greenpeace is not going to be playing this game. That's for sure. <laughs> not a chance. 28 litres. It feels like we're going to stall the engine in any second. Yeah, we're not making any progress here. 
progress is incredibly slow. So all tempted to just go to the island lake. Just to have a nosy. Just because I'm intrigued. a good shot because i said honestly unless this turns into a road which it isn't it just isn't i, I can't see us getting there 300 meters away with 24 liters of fuel just ain't happening should we go down here then i'm making a call so michigan is actually bigger than we imagined it gets even bigger again this game constantly impresses me Again, we're going to arrive and, yeah, we're probably going to be completely screwed. Island Lake. Oh, I just realized what that means. <laughs> a lot of water, basically. A lot of water. Is there a garage anywhere? Doesn't tell us. There's a bunch of watchtowers, though. This would be intriguing. If we can find some gas or a garage, that would be... Incredible. But I can't see it happening. There's a sign there, but I guess that means... Look at... Yeah, I want to go back, do I? I guess if I'm going to go in... Oh, one sec. What's that? That looks like maybe a lumber mill, potentially. There's a watchtower right here. Which is, again, too far away. Let's go this way. Oh, one sec. Is that gas? Is that gas? No, I think it's just a house. Ooh. Some objectives. I was hoping that looks like a boat upside down. But I was hoping that was going to be Gaius. It's not, it's just a boat. Oh, there's a sign here. What's it say? 18 litres of fuel left. What does it say? I bet it says lumber mill. Yeah. That is honestly the last thing I want right now. Is wood. The last thing I want. <laughs> I don't want wood right now. That watchtower actually isn't that far away. Mm, one sec. That looks like gas. That looks like gas. Potentially. Let's have a look. Again, I don't know anything about this map. I don't know Nout. I know Nout. Nothing about it. Yeah, let's have a look down here. Oh, man. Oh, it is definitely gas, though. It is definitely gas. Can I get through there, though? If I go... Why not I got all-wheel drive on, at least? There we go. We can squeeze through that. No, we can't. I'll take that back. If I winch for it. Oh, that is a squeeze. Ah! Damn it! Just a bit too big. Can't fit in my pants. Oh, oh. Oh. Getting a bit desperate here. We have now got 11 litres left. Your next decision could be very important. Oh, are we out? Are we out? Yes! We made it! We squeezed through there. With a few scratches, of course. Come on, it's just a small rock. Sometimes you need to go backwards to go forwards, if that makes sense. Why am I, am I just, like, seeing things here? I don't see what the issue is. I know there's a little rock there, but... It's like it's just stalling or something. I don't know what it's doing. This is going to burn the last bit of my fuel. But it just does not want to move. Wow. Thanks, Fleet Star. Great job. Great job. Fantastic. Uh, I don't know what was the issue there. Because it's just a bit slippy and that rock was causing us a few issues. But anyway, again, um, yeah. A slightly frustrating ending. I don't know if we could have used that trailer to fuel up the fleet star i have no idea i guess we was just slipping hitting that rock we couldn't move thank you guys for watching i hope you guys enjoyed the episode and i will see you guys very soon bye bye